hey guys welcome back to my channel ag motion designs and in today's video we are going to create this simple logo animation inside of after effects without using any plugin so without wasting any more time let's get started Here we are in After Effects. Now let's create a new composition. I'll call it as Main Animation. Width is 1920, height is 1080, frame rate is 30, duration is 30 seconds, and background color is solid black color. And hit OK. Now choose Grid and Guide option and Title Safe Action. Now I'll import my logo over here. Footage, Composition, Return, Layers, and Sizes, and import it double click on this logo com hit ctrl c to copy this logo go to the main animation and hit ctrl v instead of logo you are free to choose anything you want or you can just simply type any text for now i'll choose my channel logo i'll align it horizontally and then i'll align it vertically and press s for scaling options and decrease the scale little bit it's totally up to you you can do whatever you want for now i'll name it as my logo now hit ctrl D and instead of track mat I'll choose alpha mat now select this my logo com hit P on keyboard create one keyframe over here and at one second um, create another keyframe now go to the stat and bring it down select this keyframes hit F9 so we're getting something like this move it a little bit over here so we'll get something like this I'll adjust it over here. This looks good to me. Now hit Ctrl A to select both these layers and hit Ctrl Shift C and I'll call it as logo animation and hit OK. Now hit Ctrl Y on keyboard and create a solid black layer. I'll call it as fractal and hit OK. Now go to the effect and presets panel and apply fractal noise effect on it for instead of basic I'll choose dynamic instead of soft, soft linear I'll choose block I'll increase the contrast up to 160 increase the brightness up to 20 for the complexity I'll choose 1 go to the transform unlink this uniform scaling option increase the scale width and decrease the scale height you can choose anything you want from over here I'll choose this severely fractal type I'll decrease the contrast to 130 and for the brightness I'll choose 10 now we will animate this fractal so create one keyframe on this offset turbulence hit U go to 4 seconds and let's type over here minus 960 so we are getting this kind of animation now alt click on this evolution tab and type an expression time into 300 so we are getting this kind of animation which looks pretty good now select this fractal solid layer hit ctrl shift c to pre comp it move all attributes into the new composition and hit ok i'll bring it down over here and i'll hide it now select this logo animation comp now we will apply this displacement map over here and instead of logo one I'll choose this fractal comb so we are getting something like this for maximum vertical displacement I'll choose it zero and for the horizontal displacement I'll choose 80 now at the start create one keyframe on this maximum horizontal depressment create one keyframe over here hit u and at this point i'll make it zero select this keyframes and hit f9 so we are getting something like this if you want then you can increase this displacement and you can move it over here If you want then you can move it over here also 
select this keyframes go to the graph editor and adjust this graph editor something like this so we are getting this kind of animation and after that if you want then you can again create one tweaky displacement just like this yep this looks good to me now what i'll do is i'll hit ctrl a ctrl shift c and i'll call it as logo displacement animation and hit ok now hit ctrl d three times so we'll create these three copies now choose this last one and apply fill effect on it choose red color and it is select this third one apply fill effect and choose green color choose this third one and apply fill effect and choose blue color hit ctrl y to create a solid bg i'll call it as bg and i'll bring it down over here and i'll lock this now zoom in a little bit and just adjust this layer something like this so we are getting this glitchy logo animation which is simply pretty awesome now select this three layers and hit ctrl shift c i'll call it as logo only hit ctrl d press s for scaling option i'll link this option and instead of 100 i'll call it as minus 100 hit p and bring it down over here so it will create one reflection hit t so degree in, instead of that what you can do is just select this layer choose rectangle tool and create mask over here now go to the mask one and feathers increase this feathers hit t for opacity opacity options and just decrease the opacity so we are getting something like this so yep this is our simple logo animation or after that you can do is create one null object select these two layers and parent with this null object press s for scaling option create one keyframe and at the last up to over here i'll make it 90 so it will create zoom out effect over here so this is our simple logo animation. Thank you for watching this tutorial guys. If you like this video then please consider to subscribe my channel and also hit the bell icon to get more updates. Until then stay tuned.